This is an audiovisual representation of a study published in the Journal of Bone and Joint Surgery in 2018. Revision of a failed anterior shoulder stabilization is traditionally performed using open techniques, such as the Letarge or open Bankart procedure. An alternative to these is an arthroscopic revision using modern techniques, which has been shown to not only reduce pain and improve range of motion postoperatively, but also achieve outcomes comparable with that of an open repair. Researchers at the University of Pittsburgh Medical Center performed a retrospective study to evaluate the outcomes of arthroscopic revision anterior shoulder stabilization and determine the risk factors associated with failure. 65 patients who underwent an arthroscopic revision with a minimum of two-year follow-up were included. The surgical technique, arthroscopic findings, and rehabilitation protocol for each patient varied, and the average follow-up period was 4.7 years. 42% of the patients experienced recurrent anterior instability. Based on previous reports, this rate was higher than expected. However, 10 of the failures in this study occurred more than three years post-revision, highlighting the importance of having longer follow-up periods. Moreover, the multivariate analysis showed that there were three independent risk factors for revision failure, namely the presence of an off-track Hill-Sachs lesion, a patient age of less than 22 years, and a ligamentous laxity. In fact, Patients with an off-track Hill-Sachs lesion had a nine-fold increase in the odds of failure, while eight- and five-fold increases were noted in patients with a ligamentous laxity and in those aged under 22 years, respectively. Interestingly, the failure rate dropped to 19% when patients with these risk factors were excluded. Thus, while arthroscopic revision anterior shoulder stabilization is an alternative option for treating recurrent anterior shoulder instability, Selection of the type of surgical intervention, i.e. open or arthroscopic, should be carefully considered to minimize recurrences.